Indiana's home team. This is Fox 8 News at noon. A new procedure to treat severe sinuses has now hit the market. Studies show sinusitis uh, affecting 36 million Americans with pain and pressure. It's called sinus balloon, and it's a procedure that takes about 20 minutes to help you return to feeling normal again and back to your normal activities within 48 hours. Welcome now, Dr. Greg Pippin, an ENT specialist in New Orleans. Welcome, and you've got Thank this you new device, us. which hopefully will bring relief to many people. And you said basically you brought, before we get into details of it, but is this pretty much it? This is the entire device. This is an Intellis Express balloon. And essentially uh, what you do is you dilate the sinus passageways with the balloon. So you will gently insert the catheter into the sinus pathway, and then with this plunger, you inflate the balloon. This balloon then dilates the sinus cavity, where traditionally you would use surgical instrumentation that would uh, open the sinus cavity. Um, it's a paradigm shift in sinus surgery. Traditionally, the nose would be packed, you would have bleeding, mm -hmm. you would have a significant recovery from sinus surgery. This you can go back to work in one to two days. That is great. Let's talk about exactly what is uh, sinusitis. I mean, what are the symptoms and what causes it? Well, the, there are numerous causes. Allergies can cause it. Anatomic obstruction can cause it. Uh, typical symptoms will include facial pressure, facial pain, purulent snot or green mm -hmm. discharge from your nose, uh, a chronic uh, foul odor in the nose are all very common. And it's severe pain? Severe pain, excruciating headaches, mm -hmm. uh, uh, debilitating headaches mm -hmm. at times. Well, it affects millions of people. Um, so what do you think the advantages are if, if you were to break it down? I mean, current treatment versus this. I think this is going to be the standard of care in the very near future. Uh, my own personal experience, I've been using this device for about three years. Mm -hmm. The pressure and pain are improved much more dramatically with traditional surgery. The recovery is much quicker. And, and showing what we have on our screen here, explain this. Essentially what this diagram is showing is the balloon catheter it was inserted into a cheek sinus or the maxillary sinus and was then dilating the outflow tract so that sinus can drain normally and prevent infections. So it's helping drain? It, it prevents normal aeration or drainage to the sinus cavity. It's FDA approved. Let's talk about costs. Is this covered by insurance? It absolutely is. That's another benefit to the procedure. Mm -hmm. what, this can be done in the office, and the vast majority of these cases are done in the office. Therefore, you save on deductibles for uh, outpatient surgery centers, hospitals. The costs are often just a copay to the uh, the doctor's office. Okay, and how big a deal is this given how many people, the millions of Americans who well, suffer from this? When you look at the just the healthcare system in general, sinusitis is in the top four reasons you go to a, see a physician in the United States. Uh, so if you can offer any kind of cost savings to the system, it's going to be beneficial to the government, to the country in general, and people get back to work quicker and feel better Yeah, quicker. I've seen people like they've had to leave work. They just couldn't function. The pain, the severe sinus pain was so bad. And most local doctors will be aware of this. Uh, it's a newer technique, and more and more people are becoming aware of it as it becomes more popular. Okay, well, some hope, something new for folks suffering from severe sinus pain. Thank you so much, doctor. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.